I'd like to share with you the 10 minute rule. Do you ever have a bad moment in a day that you can't let go of and it lingers all day and before you know where you are your whole day has been ruined? You know we should get up and move on, but how do we do it? And some years ago I, I, I chose something I, I decided and I made up something called the 10 minute rule. And it was this, if, if I make a mistake, if somebody else upsets me, if I get something wrong, if I feel bad about myself, I allow myself 10 minutes to smart. 10 minutes because I'm human. And then I sit up and I think, can I do anything to correct this? So sometimes I've made a bad business deal and thinking I shot myself in the foot with that price. Can I ring the client up and tell them? And if I can, I get on and do it. And if I can't, I say, do you know what? I got that wrong. I'll learn from it. It'll do better next time. But after 10 minutes, I want to get up and start again and move on. And that doesn't work all the time. You know, there, there will be times when, and there have been times when I've pouted for an hour or I've let something bother me. The good news is the, having that ability to forgive yourself and say, I'm going to get on with it. It doesn't mean to say the 10 minute rule doesn't work. I let it go a bit that time, but I'm going back to it. Because I want to ask you a question, what's the point in staying negative? I don't want to be down there. So it's really interesting this. I think over the years now I've developed that 10 minute rule. I'm probably not going to be down to three minutes on most occasions. It is sometimes 10 minutes and sometimes it's longer. But I forgive myself, move on, learn from it and think I do want to stay positive. It's a great attitude to have. So that's a little tip and technique for staying positive. The 10 minute rule. Good luck.